Oh Lee, it charged from Ezio Canning. This is our Ezio MP7, a uh, play type pasteurizer. It's now it's ready for shipping. As the stand is a HMI touch screen, uh, you can control uh, every unit from this screen. This is a three three zone uh, heat exchanger. So first of all, the material uh, is from it comes from layer from the top and. You are going to connect uh, the steam from here. The steam will come through uh, this electrical valve and go to uh, the heating area for the cold wa for, the, for the water heating the water. This valve can uh, is an electrical driving can you can adjust uh, from the screen throughout. It. And this is a layer tank. Here is a tank. This is a water tank. So we are we'll connect the water from here and come through here and uh, go to this side. And the water will go uh, comes from the top and uh, go through the tank and go into that pump. This water is for the heating, heating and heating exchanger. All water tank can be uh, pressurized to make sure the, the water is heating enough and uh, improve the heating efficiency for the exchanger heating. So the water is go go down. So the water is comes through uh, this pump and go to the heating area there. The water will uh, start heating from this place, this place. This, uh, this is the steam comes from, and there is the uh, water comes and start heating, heating the water here. Then. The water will go. The water will go through, go out, and through this pipe. This water, hot water, and go into the heat exchanger for the pasteurizing. And the heat, the hot water will uh, go out from there here, and go back to the water tank for a self circle then let's see the product pipe it's a product tank first of all your product here will go to that pipe and go through the pipe to the product tank then the product will be pumped by this big pump to the heat exchanger. The product will come from layer pipe and go into the uh, heat exchanger for the pasteurizer. And here has the three area for the pasteurization. This is the cold, is cooling cooling area, and this is a pasteurization area, and this is the preheating area. Preheating is for a better pasteurization because uh, we couldn't just uh, bring your product to the pasteurization. We needed to uh, preheat in a product and then uh, then do the pasteurization together. So, there has another another way to.
to uh, pass the to her, to the heat exchanger from the third tank. It's from here. It's uh, another electric, electrical valve to control. Uh, this is another electrical valve. There's two. It's for the steam. This is for uh, your product. This product comes from from here and go in and this is and go from here to be this place. This is a preheating area for your another way. Another way is the product. It's for preheating. Except that the product will go out from here. You can see the pressure gauge in here. And product will come, go out from here to do a, a, a kind of a buffering circle. This uh, the buffering pipe circle is uh, for uh, avoid uh, the pressure unstable. And we need to make sure the the product in, in the pipe is stable running, stable recycling, so we, so we uh, build that pipe to, uh, to do the self-circling for, uh, for your product and uh, go, to, go, out, go back to the uh, heat exchanger. This, this can improve the heating efficiency for your product. Then the final product will go out from uh, under the uh, heat exchanger from here. The end product will come from there uh, and go go up and go up there and go to the leather pipe and go to your bright tank. So you can directly control this steam valve from the screen because this uh, is the electrical drive and you can adjust the steam volume. You can not like uh, 20% or 50% and control the product volume from here. This, uh, this, this valve can be uh, controlled to the, from the 0 to the 100% as your need. Uh, so this is the cold water comes from. So the cold water will come from here to cooling down your product in the end. Uh, if your product is juice, you don't need to uh, connect the chilled water. Just uh, use the, the normal cold water is fine. Uh, if your outlet inlet is uh, very low, you want, so you need to connect the cold water from here. And the cold water will go out from there to do a circle. Anyway, this system is custom made for a company in local. Uh, we can custom made your pasteurizer according to your product. Of course, as I said, uh, uh, all, all the functions in the screen can adjust uh, every unit for, uh, for the valve flow, flow speed and pasteurization time and uh, the cold water and the product of the valve is uh, always automatic running you just uh, click the running and you can this machine can run in itself 